All right, so in previous videos, I looked at using the WDFNW uh, Go Hunt app to look at how we can use this uh, software to scout out uh, hunting areas based on public uh, access to land for hunting. Um, also look at various uh, types of spatial data, including satellite imagery, uh, roadways, and uh, game management units. And in those videos, I ended up settling on this region here in northern Skamania County in the 560 Lewis River Game Management Unit. Um, so let's say that I, uh, I've decided I, I really want to do some early archery elk hunting in uh, this part of the state. Um, it seems very appealing to me to hunt in the shadow of a, of a recently active volcano. It sounds like an exciting thing to do, so I decide that's where I want to hunt. Um, there's lots of logging going on here, and it uh, looks like there's some forest that's been left alone, so um, I think there might be some elk in this region. But I haven't really decided um, between hunting in uh, the Lewis River unit or in the nearby uh, 516 Packwood unit. Um, so I might use uh, some of the querying tools available uh, with this, uh, this app. And I do that by going up to Queries here on the, the top of the page and you'll see this little harvest data that pops down and there's two ways that I can query harvest data I can do that uh, by reporting unit such as a game management unit or I can look at harvest statistics in general across across the state um, and select out various units by certain criteria uh, but I'm just gonna focus today on looking at it by reporting unit so I clicked on queries down to harvest data and I'll re select by reporting unit and I'll get this little query box that pops up and you can see we have various years of data uh, available I'm just gonna focus on the most recent data which is 2010 and uh, and then when I click on species you get all the different game species that um, are available for your hunting pleasure in the state of Washington and I scroll down to elk because well that's my my target species So I click on elk um, report type I can look at uh, by the type of antler so are we talking antlerless uh, three point four point five point etc or just overall harvest and I'm interested in just overall harvest because I just want to put some meat in the freezer um, and then I scroll down here to method type and you can see that there's uh, here's archery which is what I'm interested in but I can also do queries looking at modern firearm multiple weapon if you're lucky enough to draw one of those tags or muzzle loader. So I select archery because that's my hunting technique and um, I'm interested in looking at it by uh, GMU because I want to compare the 560 unit versus the 516 unit. When I select GMU I get a reporting unit box here that has all the various GMUs in it and if I scroll down through here I should be able to find uh, 560 uh, and I'll select that and I press search and it might take a little bit try it again here we go so what I see here is I get a little uh, search results box and I get the number of uh, antlered and antlerless, antlerless elk that were harvested in 2010 using archery what I see is that 68 animals were taken um, in this game management unit in 2010 using archery. Um, it's a pretty busy game management unit. There's about 1,200 archery hunters um, at least going out uh, once during the field season in that game management unit. And only about 6% of those hunters are successful. Um, you can also look at the average number of days uh, per hunter um, so it looks like hunters spend about six days on average in this game management unit and um, it taking the average of all those hunters and the number of days they spent it, it's uh, there's an average of 112 essentially uh, days in the field uh, in order to get a kill um, now clearly uh, there's not 112 days uh, available during the season but that's just an average of the 1,200 hunters going out uh, during the season for six days and coming away with about 70 elk kills. Okay, so let's uh, go and compare that to the nearby Packwood unit that I'm potentially interested in hunting. I select 516. I do a search. 
and I get my data pulled up. Okay, so let's look at the search results for the Packwood unit. And we see that far fewer animals are taken in this game management unit. Only 17 were taken in the early archery season. But we have about uh, a third of the hunters out there. So a third of the kills, a third of the hunters, it seems like the rate is fairly constant. There's slightly lower success here in this game management unit. Um, about 4%. And um, the rest of the values are fairly similar, um, about six days uh, on average hunted per hunter in that game management unit. Um, so it looks like I might either just decide to go with the Lewis River because either it's, it's closer to home or I might use um, some other technique to decide between hunting between these two game management units because it seems like uh, the hunting pressure is rel much higher in the game in the 560 Lewis River unit compared to Packwood, but the relative success uh, of hunters in those those units is about the same.